Hey everybody, welcome back. Trailer reaction time. And today we got a trailer that's kind of a blind trailer, but not really. We're going to watch trailer number one for Goodbye, Christopher Robin. Um, so if you want to watch this trailer without me in the way, there's a link in the description below. Or something's popping up right about now. You can click on that, check it out, come on back, watch this with me. And then we'll geek out over it together, should it be geek out worthy. However, I do have to say, though, I am a little Winnie the Pooh, okay? I'm a little familiar with Winnie the Pooh. I did watch some when I was a kid. It's not really my jam, so I'm not as excited for this as maybe some of you guys might be. So if I don't get jazzed by this, you know, don't take offense or anything. We all like different things. Again, you got to remember, I grew up as a horror kid. I got to watch all the great horror movies, all the great sci-fi movies. So Disney and, and the standardized children's stuff of that era was not as uh, prevalent in my life as it might be for a lot of other people. But this trailer could be pretty interesting. And other than that, I don't really know anything about it other than I guess the boy is Christopher Robin. Like, I I know the name from the Winnie, Pooh, Winnie the Pooh universe. Universe, but I don't know what else we're really in store for here. I don't know if this is a biopic. I don't know what this is going to be. So I guess one way to fix that is to click on the buttons and check it out. And it's so weird because I just watched the Death Wish remake trailer. So this is going to be a really weird juxtaposition of tone for me. But let's do it. Whoops. There we go. God bless mommy. God bless daddy. <sighs> what the fuck? God bless new. Amen. Forgotten someone. Who? Keep thinking. Me. I forgot to bless me. God bless me. Are you supposed to do that? The funniest writer ready to put the smile back on our faces. What do we fight that war for? But it is over. What am I doing about it? You're doing what you're good at, writing plays. I had enough of making people laugh. I want to make them see. I need to get out of London, somewhere quiet and trying to think for once. You're going to live here. This is your new home. <laughs> Mommy says you're writing a book. Stop people going to war. Mm. I think your book is a jolly good idea. You're the only one that does. I'd really like if you wrote a book for me. I'd definitely read it. <laughs> Shall we go for a walk? Aren't you working? It doesn't seem likely. <laughs> Can you think of a good name for a donkey? Eeyore. They'll be gone in a minute. Bees are good, aren't they? They just want to make honey. Yes, uh, I completely forgot about bees. Life is full of frightful things. The great thing is to find something to be happy about. I think I've got something for us. Ernest and I are putting your bear in a book. We're putting you in it too. What will you call me in the book? Your real name, Christopher Robin. Let's be hunters in the snow. Come on, don't get frostbite. The creatures in the story are toys. They're toys, but the woods are real. Winnie the Pooh. It's rather inexplicable. Yes. Evening news was put Christopher on the front page. Why does everyone like Winnie the Pooh so much? After the war, there was so much sadness. Then Winnie the Pooh came along. Shall we go to the woods? I've got heaps of writing to do, I'm afraid. He has to be allowed to grow up. He has to know he's important. Radio interview, newspaper interview. He can't do all this. He's rather good, isn't he? He's a little boy. Come on, then. Where to? Home, I should think. <laughs> Um, that actually looks really good. I actually even got a little teary at the end for some reason. I don't know why. I don't really relate to any of it. But, um, no, that actually looks like a really well-made movie. I actually really want to see that. I, I guess that's the power of having low expectations. But, um, that looked fantastic, actually. Uh, and already, just from the trailer, I learned a lot more about the behind-the-scenes of Winnie the Pooh than I ever knew. And now I'm fascinated and want to learn more. So... Good job, movie trailer. You've sold me. That's what a great trailer should do. It sold me on a movie I didn't care to, I didn't care about. Now I want to go see that movie. So right on. All right. We'll be watching more of those trailers. We'll see if we go see that one. See how much of a fan Mary is. We might get to the theater for that. But what did you guys think? Are you excited for that? Did that look really cool? Were you hyped for it and it hit your expectations or missed your expectations? You like me. It wasn't a fan and maybe the trailer tro sold you on it. Uh, trolled you on it. Um, let me know. I mean, geek out with me in the comments. That was absolutely geek out worthy. That was a beautiful trailer. And it looks like it might be a beautiful film. So I'm excited for that. All right. Other than that, though, you can click that thumbs up button. Give me the good old thumb of encouragement as I do love to be encouraged. And I'm going to get out of here and go watch some more stuff. And I'll see you all later.